Travis, B2B3, Jen with uh, Seuss Republic of Gamers, we're on Team ROG, and I'm uh, here with Walker, Farmer, Nemesis, we're both overclocking on stage at BlizzCon 2011. Here at the Asus booth, we've got two different systems set up here, we have a three-way SLI with GTX 570s, and a liquid nitrogen cooled i5 2500K running about 5.7 gigahertz. We've also got some 2400 megahertz. Corsair Dominator GTX 3 dual channel memory. We're running about uh, 2100, 2200 megahertz on it. This is all powered by the new ASUS Maximus 4 Extreme Z motherboard. This has the Z68 chipset. And uh, here we also have the same motherboard configuration, but we're running a 2600K. We've got the copper liquid nitrogen cooling container on here. We're simply just going to pour the liquid nitrogen directly in there, and that's going to remove the heat that's generated by overclocking. The temperatures that we're using, uh, for example, this 2600K is going to be about minus 40 centigrade, and we're going to clock this up to about 5.7 gigahertz with four cores and eight threads enabled. We also have a Matrix 580 Platinum graphics card. And uh, this graphics card is an upgraded triple slot cooler. It has 19 phase power, takes two 8 pin power connectors. Uh, some of the unique features on it, if you can see back here, we have a, a button here that allows uh, forcing the fan speed to pull. You can increase and decrease voltage on the fly with the motherboard. And uh, you can show uh, LEDs here that indicate how much voltage you're applying directly to the GPU core. And uh, what I have running on here is a PCI Express extension cable. This is a 12 inch Gen 2 cable. Allowed allows me to move the graphics card farther away from the motherboard and in effect what we're going to be doing is taking uh, one of Kingpin Cooling's liquid nitrogen containers here, this is a, called a Tech 9 Fat Boy, and this is going to be mounted directly to the graphics card and we'll pour the liquid nitrogen just like the CPU. We're going to be running temperatures down uh, minus 196 degrees Celsius and we'll take this graphics card a little bit over 1500 megahertz will effectively be doubling the speed of the system here. Welcome. Okay, so yeah, I was looking at the um, extreme overclocking that uh, these uh, extreme overclockers here and it's uh, enjoying the Zeus booth here at BlizzCon uh, 2000. Oh no. 